In LTM Designer, uh, the components required for your project might not be listed in the given libraries here. So, if your uh, components are not among the listed libraries, you can either create your own by going into new library. You can create an integrated library, a schematic, and a PCB library. Or the other way you can do is you can download the LTM designer free library loader. It makes your job rather easy. You can download your required components directly from online databases. You just visit this website. And you can download from here. Download and install. Just click this and save it. Once it is done, you need to unzip and then install the library. The sorry, this uh, library loader. Okay, that's done. Open the folder. I'm going to zip it. Unzip somewhere. Okay. Here I'll visit this LTM library loader. And here you can just here the extension is dot ex underscore. I, I'll just change it to exe. Yes, and now it's an executable file. I'll just run as administrator. Press yes. Next. Next. It says that uh, on relaunching LTM Designer, you'll be able to run the library loader. Okay. and it says that please close the LTM designer My, I have opened LTM designer I'll just close it so that the setup completes its operation ok uh, now I'll press next again ok and now it's, it's been installed alright so now let me try Again, now I'll open LTM Designer one more time. Just try to click run as administrator. Yes. Okay, so now the LTM designer has opened and now I can go to file and here you can see symbol, footprint and 3D model. So from here we can load a new symbol. But before before going that uh, going there, uh, here you can see the we need to make a few settings here if uh, we are not uh, registered at this uh, website we first need to go to that website and uh, make a username and password hmm. let me try one So the login is successful and now I can search for any component. So let me type in IR2110 for instance and I'll just press search. Make sure you, you are connected to the internet because it will search this component uh, on the internet.
Okay, so now uh, you can see uh, my, there are number of components um, paired to 110s to 110bf. Okay, they, they change, there's a little change in their specification. So whatever you, you want, just click one and you can press add to design. It will take a while. So as you can see, it's building you that uh, footprint for you, making your job easy. And okay, now it says please please check the bottom corner of your schematic to drag the component IR2110 into the desired position. Okay, just now you, you can close it. And here on the left you can see we have these uh, we, we have these uh, components on the schematic here. This is the schematic symbol, and then we have this um, PCB footprint. Find out. Okay, so uh, on the on the schematic where we we have loaded. You can find this component in the bottom here and you can drag it to your circuit wherever you want to place it All right so so that's how you can uh, add your add a component using the uh, library loader and that's it try it and uh, it will make the job easy for you thank you